Hello everyone, my name is Vishal and in today's tutorial I will guide you how to use object style in CorelDRAW and how can you save a lot of time with the help of this feature. So let's get started with the object styles. So as you can see I have already created one document and it is of total 5 pages. Currently I am on page number 1, page number 2, 3, 4 and the last page. So I am going to create a style first and then I am going to apply it. So to create style you have to first open object style. So there are various way, method of opening object style. The very first is go to windows menu, dockers and inside the dockers you will find object style. The short key for this is control plus F5. You can also go to the small plus sign and click over here. When you click, you will find the object style. If it is already checked, that means it is already there in the dockers. So as you can see, I have opened object styles. Now with the help of styles, you can create styles for various things. For outline, fill, transparency, character, text, paragraph text, frame and many other things. So in this example, I am going to show you how to apply style for outline, fill, character, text paragraph text etc so for this i am going to create one style for outline one style for fill style for character and style for paragraph text as you can see i have added four styles in the style stalker over here now very quickly i am going to apply shapes take a paragraph text apply a dummy text to it and also let me create one paragraph text now after creating our artistic text we'll set a style so i'll go to outline inside the outline i will define what should be the color of my outline what should be the thickness of my outline? Let me take it pixels and I'll take it 10 pixel outline and I can also define the style of my outline. So now let me take this style, right? Currently I'm just defining the style for my outline. In the same manner I will define the style for fill as well. So let's say I want to apply a fountain fill, elliptical fill and I'm going to apply what should be the elliptical fill so outer color will be blue shade and the inner I want of something orange right and the same manner I am applying style for character as well so I want a font let's say asset the font size will be 20 points and the fill for it will be shade of red and for paragraph I will go for the line spacing of 150 percentage and it will be center line now after defining the style in the object style I have to apply the same style to the objects for example I am going to apply the outline to this ellipse so I will just select the ellipse go to outline and there is option apply to selection now whatever is selected in that the same style which i have defined over here will get applied click now can you see the style is applied to it i am applying the fill to this uh, square select the square go to fill apply to selected whatever i have defined over here it is all applied over here very quickly i am going to apply for the paragraph text also apply to selected and to the artistic text as well so character and apply to selected now whatever i have created in the object style is now applied now the best part with the object style is now whenever you have applied this style if you want to make changes later let me go to the page number one and inside the page number one let's say i want to apply i want to apply the same style to this so i'll just go to character apply to selected now whatever style i have defined it is applied over here now if I go to paragraph text, I'll just click, apply the paragraph style to it. 
in the same manner i am going to apply the same fill to this shape i'll go to fill apply to selected so i am going to apply the same style to on various pages so now let's say very quickly after applying the style but the best part is if later on i want to make any changes to my style without going to individual place i will just make changes to the style section and the same thing will get applied over here now for example i don't want the outline which i have applied over here let me apply the same outline to this also okay i am applying the same outline to this as well outline right now i have applied style of outline over here also and it is on the page number 1 as well now later i want to change the style for my uh outline so i can simple go to a different style now no matter after changing it will reflect the changes on all the pages where i have applied so currently the fill of the square and the page number 1 fill is same If I want to change the fill, I will just go to the property of fill. I will make changes to it. Let's say I will just change the color to blue to any other color, right? And now, because I have made the changes over here, it will get applied to everywhere where I have applied this. Now, I believe that this 150 percent is is less. If I want to increase it, go back to paragraph, increase. the spacing over here i'll make it 180 percentage now everywhere where i have applied this paragraph style it will also get change according to this can you see it is also changed now to 180 percentage now no need to go to any individual pages just make changes to the style and wherever the style is applied it will also get changed according to the changes required i hope this tutorial is helpful for you if you have any question put it in the comment box i will try to revert as early as possible thank you so much for watching